I am replacing my sleeper heater core. Uh, for a very long time, I've been driving this truck. I can smell a bad smell. Uh, I could never pinpoint where it was coming from. And I wish I did uh, early on uh, because it was coming from the uh, a leaky heater core. I never turned on my heat in the back or AC in the sleeper uh, because of the bad smell and it just never clicked that I could have a leaky heater core and the one the only way that I was able to tell I have a leaky heater core is by looking at the hoses that comes out and there were drips of antifreeze right there and that's what made me think if I have a leaky heater core uh, the job is very easy you do need the heater core and it does come separate you do need the uh, two aluminum pipes you also need two o-rings that's what I took from inside the truck that's the location I had to take a few of these this type of clamps uh, I had to take there is a plastic piece that covers um, no actually I'm sorry the plastic piece that goes over here I took it out just to give me an easier access and those pieces were around this whole black box even around that fan box so I had to take them all off and you got these to tighten the uh, aluminum hoses to one side to the heater core and the other side to the frame of the truck right here this one goes on the bottom on this side and this one goes on the top easy job I wish I found out about it long time ago but unfortunately that's a health hazard for sure I will be sleeping much better now thank you have a good day